What is going on guys? This is Sid Plays 87 coming at you with part 5 of a 4 million coin pack opening video. And yes, I have sold off a lot of my players and you can check the previous videos to see which players I sold off and what I have packed so far, but I'm going to get into a huge FIFA 19 pack and play video to end FIFA 19. But with that being said, they have just dropped FIFA 20 news, big news. They have dropped the top 10 players. The ratings are here. So I just want to go over with you. I just want to talk really quickly about the top 10 players that they have given us so far. This information. Number one, Messi. Number two, Ronaldo. Number three, Neymar. Number four, Hazard. Number five, De Bruyne. Number six, Oblak. Seven, Van Dyke. Eight, Salah. 9, Modric, 10, Ter Stegen, and sooner or later, all the ratings are going to be up on the website. The website is giving a little bit of a problem right now. It hasn't been updated, but let's just go through these players in the meantime. The Messi card is still 94, um, 87 pace, 92 shooting, 92 passing, 96 dribble, 39 defending, 66 physicality. Okay, so that's pretty similar to his if we're just looking and see what his regular card is here his 94 um what was his 94 88 91 right so this is 87 92 so he does increase in shooting and um his passing as well uh dribbling has stayed the same physicality is up this is actually a much better card than his 94 card so as a right wing he's going to be insane in comparison to his other card okay moving on let's check out the original Ronaldo card and just get an idea just get an idea of how this is um, in comparison with his uh, with his 94 FIFA 19 card so he is getting a downgrade he is 93 rated he's a little older now so 90 pace 93 shot that's the sim that's similar right now 82 passing so right now his passing has improved his dribbling has gone down by one point 35 defend 35 defending um physicality has dropped one so all in all it's not too bad of a downgrade it is a downgrade it is in the striker position so of course he's still gonna be really really op so yes now let us move on to the neymar card that is the third card and his rating is going to his overall rating will stay the same how does it compare it's 91 pace 85 shooting so his FIFA 19 car was 92 84 so yeah once more 91 85 so he does get that that shooting increase pace downgrade okay his passing has been improved it's 87 passing so that's great his dribbling stays the same uh, physicality has dropped by one and his defending is the same so all in all this is still a really good card, a, 90, a really great 92 rated card. And now we are going to get to one of the biggest transfer signings um, of the season, and that is Eden Hazard. And he is 91 rated, if I am not mistaken. Yes, 91 rated. And it is very similar to his Chelsea card. Um, let's see, 91 pace, 83 shooting, 86 passing, 94 dribble 35 defending 66 physicality okay how does that compare that's his new card i'm giving you by the way so 83 shooting his shot his shooting has gone up one his passing has remained the same his dribbles remain the same his physicality has gone up all in all it's a better card um so yeah eden hazard does have a better card and we get right into um kevin de bruyne and uh yeah you you could say his name a million ways but yeah um yeah moving right along to the first uh you know the top 10 um and we are looking at his base card how does it compare um his new card is 70 this is a little hard to read 76 pace so he does get a pace downgrade in his new card 86 shooting stays the same his passing stays the same his dribbling stays the same his defending goes up one 
and his physicality stays the same. All right, so all in all, it's a pretty similar card. How it's gonna play, um, that's, that's, that, you know, we'll see. But yeah, next card up on the list for the top 10 cards are, all right, um, it will be Jan Oblak. And he does get, he does get a plus one. So, with that being said, um, his original card, um, we're looking at on the screen while we are running through his new card. So his new card is listed as 87 diving, 92 handling, 78 kick, uh, kicking, uh, 89 reflexes, 50 speed, and 90 positioning. So how does that compare? His diving went up one. His handling is the same. All right. Um, his reflexes are the same. His kicking is the same. His speed has gone up. That is amazing. And his positioning has gone up. So yes, this will be a beast card in the back. Hell yeah. I am so stoked for that. And yes, this guy, the, the new up and coming beast center back has a lot of promise to him. He just has to remain consistent and he will absolutely blow everyone out of the water. So in terms of better center backs, current center backs you know he still has a long way to go to make it amongst you know the best center backs in the world but he is very very promising he's showing a lot of promise and he's very humble i really like that about this guy and yes he gets an upgrade of plus two so now in night in 20 he is a 90 rated center back so 77 pace he gets a pace increase 60 shooting he gets a downgrade there so he's, so that's that's a little that's a little sad, but his passing is improved by plus one. His dribbling is 72 rated, it stays the same. His defending, that is where there's the biggest increase. It is 90 defending, 86 physicality. So yes, this will be the premier center back in the game to play with. So yes, let us move right along to Mr. Mo Salah, right? Uh, yeah, this guy is a beast for Liverpool as well. So we go from back to back Liverpool players and let's take a look at his base card. And his base card was 88 rated in FIFA 19. And while we're looking at the base card, I'm gonna read out to you the ratings. It is a 90 right winger, um, 93 pace. So he's gone up one, 86 shooting. He's gone up in shooting. His finesses are gonna be insane at the starting of FIFA. 81 passing, his passing does increase. Um, his dribbling is 89. It stays the same. 45 defending, 74 physicality. So Salah is going to be a threatening, threatening card to play with in the Premier League. And yes, that is a very overpowered league. Um, so yes, now we move on to, at one time, one of the best players in the world, Luka Modric. Okay, so this guy everyone was expecting the downgrade so it comes as no surprise um he gets a minus one so he's 74 pace 76 shooting um 89 passing uh 90 dribble 72 defending his his defending has gone up but that, that that's not bad and his physicality is 66 so all in all, it's, 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 it's just a slight downgrade from the 91 rated card in FIFA 19. So the FIFA 20 card does look promising and hopefully he can, you know, get a lot of informs early on to help, you know, give him a little bit of a boost, a resurgence. And finally, to round out the top 10 players will be Ter Stegen. Okay, so we are going to look at his regular card to give you... Um, an update on how he is. He is a 90 rated goalkeeper in FIFA 20. So he does get a plus one um, in comparison to his regular card here. And what's the difference? 88 diving. So he goes plus one there. 85 handling the same. 88 kicking the same. 90 reflexes the same. Okay, so they increase the speed. Yeah, this card was really, really slow and it felt it in game. Uh, 88 positioning that says 88 yeah it does okay so that's actually not a bad card you know um that little up upgrade is nice so yeah 
Um, this this has been a break from the pack openings. Please check out the the um yeah check out. Uh, let me just list this up. Um, I am doing that huge pack and play. I am I'm in the middle of selling every card. So yeah, that's been the top ten players. And yeah, we can go through the top twenty, but those are the most promising players of FIFA. 20 and that looks amazing so this has been a very short intermission video for fifa 20 and and i am in between this massive massive four million coin pack opening so i do have you know my final my final fifa 19 video a pack and play video for you before the demo gets released the rumor is that it will be released tomorrow so let's just cross our fingers and hope for that but yeah this has been sid plays 87 coming at you with another update hopefully hopefully this has been helpful to you in some way shape or form who are you looking forward to playing with that is the real question and i will probably be giving you the next 10 players if you know if you know if 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 time does you know if time is on my side but um yeah other guys will be giving uh, giving you out similar similar um thoughts but yeah for me right now the premier league is an overpowered league it's looking like and i think the ronaldo card the ronaldo card will still um will still be one of the most dangerous cards in fifa because he is a striker in the game and yeah um it seems like the premier league will be the league you know um the Premier League and La Liga will be the two leagues, um, which is most likely the case always. But um, yeah, those will be the two major, major leagues. And yeah, um, I guess, I guess, I guess my hybrid squad will be looking like that at the beginning of FIFA 20 Ultimate Team. All right, this has been Sid Plays once more. Sid Plays 87. Um, tune in for my massive pack opening. I will be doing part five. I will talk to you guys shortly. Peace.